Our team coverage as we continue to rebound for months now. Many of our seniors have been living in isolation all over during this pandemic. And tonight, News 5's Patrick Nelson shows us some of the work being done to stay in touch and make sure our seniors have everything they need. For many seniors, a phone call from someone who cares is a powerful moment in their lives right now. Silver Key is just one of our local organizations who is making regular calls to seniors to make sure they feel connected and they have access to any services they may need. The coronavirus has targeted parents, grandparents, and older adults. Seniors make up a large part of our most vulnerable population that has been isolated for months now. Retired nurse, author, and educator Joanne Ruth is one of those seniors. In our normal lives, when we go on day to day, we, we may be lonely, but this is a different kind of loneliness. It's an isolation that, that takes away all of our normal activities. She recognizes the mental health challenges going on right now. Going out shopping, going to the, to the senior center, going to church, all those things are lost now. And then we say, well, who am I as a senior? Well, how do I count? And does anybody know I'm alive? And do they care? All right, what kind of service do, would you like? It's why local organizations partnering with the Pikes Peak Area Agency on Aging are making check-in calls. Do you, you look at your email frequently? We'll get your email. Also known as reassurance calls to stay in touch with our local seniors to get them what they need. Melissa Martz of the Pikes Peak Area Agency on Aging says work continues to try to connect with any seniors who feel alone or may have slipped through the cracks during outreach efforts. Who don't we know and who are the older adults that, you know, are kind of under the radar that, you know, are kind of home alone a lot. Working to empower area seniors, the Pikes Peak Area Agency on Aging worked to distribute busy bags to seniors full of coloring pages, crayons, puzzles, stress balls, and information about local resources. I think it just means a lot to know that we can have an opportunity to let a person know that people do care and that we want to hear what they're thinking and what they're curious about and what they want help with. As reassurance calls continue as a way to check in on seniors in our community, Joanne says these can be life-saving conversations because there are still many difficult days ahead. I'm hoping so much that the vaccines will work, but I've made up my mind that this is kind of my way of life until that happens. I was pretty startled when I realized that might mean a year that I would be living in this in this manner of different isolation that I hadn't felt before. So yes, reaching out to people is probably the greatest life-saving thing we can do. Protecting and caring for our seniors is a team effort here in the Pikes Peak region, powered by many volunteers. This could be your chance to get involved and make a difference during this pandemic. For ways to volunteer and to connect seniors in your life to resources, you can head to our website, koaa.com rebound. Always watching out for you. Patrick Nelson, News 5.